In this last video on our deployment section, I want to show you how you can access your database on production via the command line. So to do it, it's pretty similar to how you'd access it locally. Type in Heroku run Rails C, and this is going to go, as you can see right here, it's going to go to Edutectional dash Tasky or whatever your application is, and it's going to give you the Rails console for your production server. So to access it, we can do anything. We know that we created a project, right? So we know we can run a query on that. We can create different items. You can treat this exactly the same way you treat the Rails console. So I'm going to type in project.last, hit return, and it will bring back that one project we have. If I do user.all.count, it's going to bring back our one user right there. So you can also run queries if you wanted to do something like uh, create a task. You could create a task right here and assign it to one of the projects and do everything exactly like you did from the Rails console. So this is something really powerful. This is something that I use on a very regular basis for a production application, whether it's going and running some test queries on the production database. If it's debugging, this is definitely something I think will come in handy for you. So that's how you access the Rails console on Heroku.